Hi, John Rain here. And I can remember seeing a Christmas carol for the very first time, how it affected me. I've always wanted to do my version of that classic tale. And now with the help of my Pole Star family, we've done just that. I hope you enjoy my version of this timeless piece and it may affect you in some very special way this holiday season. So from us to you, Merry Christmas.
Hello? Can you please untie me? Who are you? Hey. Hey, what are you doing? Hello? Little girl. Please help me. Who are you? What are you doing? Why am I always surprised what I find in here? Who are you? Answer me, you son of a bitch! Why do they always yell? Why can't you speak normally? Why can't you just talk? Yelling demands when you can't even stand up. Little girl, you should be kinder. I have a job to do. That's why I'm here. There are others. There are many others that I have to attend to. So if you'll be nicer to me, then I will be nicer to you. Please, I just want to go home. That's the next phase. We both know that's not possible. You can't go anywhere, ever. This is your future. It's your present. This is everything you wanted. I don't want this. I don't want to be in this room. I don't want to be here with you. I don't even know you. Think, Ava. Think really hard. What's the last thing you remember? I was in the bathroom. I was in the bathtub. I closed my eyes. And what did you have? What were you doing? I slit my wrist. Yes, now we're getting somewhere. You mean I'm dead? What were you expecting? You slit your wrist and lay down in a bathtub. What did you think was going to happen? This is what you wanted. It just wasn't what you were expecting. Are you the devil? Let's not get crazy. No, no, no. I'm a keeper of time. Your time, everyone's time. And I don't like it when somebody upsets my books. How did I mess up your books? It wasn't your time. You had life left. What is that? What is that thing? That is the essence of your pity. Creature formed by you, the essence of you. He holds your heart. There. See? You had your whole life ahead of you. Don't you feel silly now? Let's take a look. Shall we? <laughs> Why would you show me that? It's nothing you haven't seen before. I wouldn't do that. You already did. Oh, this is such a hideous place. This is the game you started. Let's see more. No! No more! No! I don't know who that is. Oh. This is going to be tough. What is that? What's in that present? That, my dear, is the soul of your daughter. I didn't have a daughter. But you would have! You took her life when you took yours. No. no. Oh, what 
suffering to afflict on you. Already dead. That was in the earth essence. This is your spirit body. What are you doing? No. No. What are you doing? Relax. No. 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 Ah! Ah! Hey, son of a bitch! Ah! Look. Nothing. No blood. You felt everything, didn't you? You did this to yourself. But there's still more. Let's take a look. That would have been your husband. That's your perfect life. You, him, your daughter. You changed his destiny too. And it's not good. What is this? Hell? Does this look like hell? Have you ever read the Bible? Where am I? You're in between two worlds. If you would have waited, if you would have waited for your time, you could have passed judgment. But no. You killed yourself. You've made a lot of work for me, and you've made a lot of people very angry. upset him the most. pleasure of watching you suffer. What do you mean? I'm dead already. As I've said before, if you would have waited until your time, it would have been different. You could have been greeted by fortunate souls. As it sits, you took your own life. You have a debt to pay. A debt? To who? A debt to death. That helps me fix everything. You have to suffer the rest of the time you had left on Earth here. How long is that? Oh, let's see, it was... 63 years. 63 years? I would have been 84 years old. What a beautiful life you gave up. So now you have to take the time that you had left on Earth and spend it here. Wait. I have to be here for 63 years? Those are the rules. It'll seem longer. Trust me. I would make it sooner, but death would be very unhappy with me. And so would agony and affliction. Shut up! They know how to hurt you. You can't beat it. When you were on Earth and distressed, you could have gotten stronger. Just shut up! Okay. It's about time I leave anyway. Huh? That would be Slake. He's telling me that the boss man is coming. <laughs> huh. 
How's our new guest doing? She's doing, well, as to be expected. How many years on this one? 63. Well, have fun. Take your time. We'll see you soon. Our time is up here, and I must bid you adieu. Wait. You can't leave me here. I have others to see. No. Many others. No. You will pardon me if I don't shed a tear. It's not in me. Please. Please. No. No. Please. Goodbye. No. Uh, yeah, this package I believe was delivered to my house by accident. I'm like 922 Hillcrest or 922 Longview. Uh, I kind of opened it before I realized it wasn't for me, so I'm sorry about that. Thank you um, for bringing it back. I appreciate Absolutely, that. Absolutely, you're welcome. I mean, well, you have a Merry Christmas. You too, Merry Christmas. Thank you. Would you want to uh, maybe come in for a cup of coffee or something? Sure, that would be nice. 